Welcome to Careers and Jobs in the USA number 4, Chefs and Head Cooks. Learn about careers and jobs in the United States of America and improve your American English with Maestro Circe. What Chefs and Head Cooks Do Chefs and head cooks typically do the following. Check the freshness of food and ingredients. Supervise and coordinate activities of cooks and other food preparation workers. Develop recipes and determine how to present dishes. Plan menus and ensure the quality of meals. Inspect supplies, equipment, and work areas for cleanliness and functionality. Hire, train, and supervise cooks and other food preparation workers. Order and maintain an inventory of food and supplies. Monitor sanitation practices and follow kitchen safety standards. Chefs and head cooks use a variety of kitchen and cooking equipment, including step-in coolers, high-quality knives, meat slicers, and grinders. They also have access to large quantities of meat, spices, and produce. Some chefs use scheduling and purchasing software to help them in their administrative tasks. Chefs who run their own restaurant or catering business are often busy with kitchen and office work. Some chefs use social media to promote their business by advertising new menu items or addressing customer reviews. Chefs and Head Cooks Types Executive chefs, head cooks, and chefs de cuisine are responsible primarily for overseeing the <clears throat> operation of a kitchen. They coordinate the work of sous chefs and other cooks who prepare most of the meals. Executive chefs also have many duties beyond the kitchen. They design the menu, review food and beverage purchases, and often train cooks and other food preparation workers. Some she executive chefs primarily handle administrative tasks and may spend less time in the kitchen. Sous chefs are a kitchen second in command. They supervise the restaurant cooks, prepare meals, and report results to the head chefs. In the absence of the head chef, sous chefs run the kitchen. Private household chefs typically work full-time for one client, such as a corporate executive, university president, or diplomat, who regularly entertains as part of his or her official duties. Chefs and head cooks, work environment and work schedules. Chefs and head cooks work in restaurants, hotels, private households, and other food service establishments. All of the cooking and food preparation areas in these facilities must be kept clean and sanitary. Chefs and head cooks usually stand for long periods and work in a fast-paced environment. Some self-employed chefs run their own restaurants or catering businesses, and their work can be more stressful. For example, outside the kitchen, they often spend many hours managing all aspects of the business to ensure that bills and salaries are paid and that the business is profitable. Injuries and Illnesses Chefs and head cooks risk injury in kitchens, which are usually crowded and potentially dangerous. Common hazards include burns from hot ovens, falls on slippery floors, and cuts from knives and other sharp objects. But these injuries are seldom serious. To reduce the risk of harm, Workers often wear long sleeve shirts and long slip, non slip shoes. Work schedules. Most chefs and head cooks work full time, including early mornings, late evenings, weekends, and holidays. Many chefs 
and head cooks work more than 40 hours a week. Chefs and Head Cooks, How to Become One, Part 1. Most chefs and head cooks learn their skills through work experience. Others receive training at a community college, technical school, culinary arts school, or four-year college. A small number learn through apprenticeship programs or in the armed forces. Education. Although post-secondary education is not required for chefs and head cooks, many attend programs at community colleges, technical schools, culinary arts schools, and four-year colleges. Candidates are typically required to have a high school diploma or equivalent to enter these programs. Students in culinary programs spend most of their times in kitchens uh, pr practicing their cooking skills. Programs cover all aspects of kitchen work, including menu planning, food sanitation procedures, and purchasing and inventory methods. Most training programs also require students to gain experience in a commercial kitchen through an internship or apprenticeship program. Work experience in a related occupation. Most chefs and head cooks start by working in other positions, such as line cooks, learning cooking skills from the chefs they work for. Many spend years working in kitchens before gaining enough experience to be promoted to chef or head cook positions. Chefs and Head Cooks, How to Become One, Part 2, Important Qualities. Business Skills. Executive chefs and chefs who run their own restaurant need to understand the restaurant business. They should know how to budget for supplies, set prices, and manage workers so that the restaurant is profitable. Communication skills. Chefs must communicate their instructions clearly and effectively to staff so that customers' orders are prepared correctly. Creativity. Chefs and head cooks need to be creative in order to develop and prepare interesting and innovative recipes. They should be able to use various ingredients to create appealing meals for their customers. Dexterity. Chefs and head cooks need excellent dexterity, including proper knife techniques for cutting, chopping, and dicing. Leadership skills. Chefs and head cooks must have the ability to motivate kitchen staff and develop constructive and co cooperative working relationships with them. Physical stamina. Chefs and head cooks often work long shifts and sometimes spend entire evenings on their feet, overseeing the preparation and serving of meals. Sense of taste and smell. Chefs and head cooks must have a keen sense of taste and smell in order to inspect food quality and to design meals that their customers will enjoy. Time management skills. Chefs and head cooks must efficiently manage their time and the time of their staff. They ensure that meals are pre prepared correctly and that customers are served on time, especially during busy hours. Chefs and head cooks. Training, licenses, certifications, and registrations. Some chefs and head cooks train on the job, where they learn the same skills as in a formal education program. Some train in uh, mentorship programs, where they work under the direction of an experienced chef. Executive chefs, head cooks, and sous chefs who work in upscale restaurants often have many years of training and experience. Chefs and head cooks also may learn through apprenticeship programs sponsored by professional culinary institutes, industry associations, or trade unions. Some of these apprenticeship programs are registered with the U.S. Department of Labor. Apprenticeship programs generally last two years and combine instruction and on-the-job training. Apprentices typically receive about 2,000 hours of both instruction 
and paid on the job training per year. Courses typically cover food sanitation and safety, basic knife skills, and equipment operation. Apprentices spend the rest of their training learning practical skills in a commercial kitchen under a chef's supervision. The American Culinary Federation accredits more than 200 academic training programs at post-secondary schools and sponsors apprenticeships around the country. The basic qualifications required for entering an apprenticeship program are as follows. Minimum age of 17, high school education or equivalent, licenses, certifications, and registrations. Although not required, certification can show competence and lead to advancement and higher pay. The American Culinary Federation certifies personal chefs in addition to various levels of chefs, such as certified sous chefs or certified executive chefs. Certification standards are based primarily on work-related experience and formal training. Minimum work experience for certification can range from about six months to five years, depending on the level of certification. Chefs and head cooks pay. The median average uh, annual wage for chefs and head cooks was $53,380 in May 2020. The median wage is the wage at which half the workers in an occupation earned more than the amount, that amount, and half earned less. The lowest 10% earned less than $30,300, and the highest 10% earned more than $90,790. The level of pay for chefs and head cooks varies greatly by region and employer. Pay is usually highest in upscale restaurants and hotels, where many executive chefs work, as well as in major metropolitan and resort areas. Most chefs and head cooks work full-time and often work early mornings, late evenings, weekends, and holidays. Many chefs and head cooks work more than 40 hours a week. Chefs and Head Cooks Job Outlook Employment of chefs and head cooks is projected to grow 6% from 2019 to 2029, faster than the average for all occupations. Income growth will result in greater demand for high-quality dishes at a variety of dining venues. As a result, more restaurants and other dining places are expected to open to satisfy consumer desire for dining out. Consumers are continuing to demand healthier meals made from scratch in restaurants, in cafeterias, in grocery stores, and by catering services. To ensure high-quality dishes, these establishments are increasingly hiring experienced chefs to oversee food preparation. Job Prospects Job opportunities should be best for chefs and head cooks with several years of work experience in a kitchen. Many job openings will result from the need to replace workers who leave the occupation. The fast pace, time demands, and high energy levels required for these jobs often lead to a high rate of turnover. There will be strong competition for jobs at upscale restaurants, hotels, and casinos where the pay is typically highest. Workers with a combination of business skills, previous work experience, and culinary creativity should have the best job prospects. Chefs and Head Cooks Summary 2020 Median Pay $53,380 per year, 
$25.66 per hour. Typically entry level, typical entry level education, high school diploma or equivalent. Work experience in a related occupation, five years or more. Number of jobs, 2019, 148,700. Job outlook, 2019, 2029, 6%, faster than average. Employment change, 2019 to 2029, 9,500.